So, tell, tell us about the special features of Vanishing Point 2. Um, special features are um, a myriad of special features. Um, it's a specially designed hull which gives you a fantastic fuel uh, efficiency from the boat. So, um, it also has got a lot of other attributes so that when you're in a sea, pushed up against the tower, the bows of the boat don't bump up and down all the time, make it impossible to uh, to deposit your your technician to the tower. So it's uh, it's really quite quite unique in this country at the moment. And you've had a years of experience in designing and building boats. Yes. How many years experience have you had? Well, we started designing in about 1975 and built our first big boat in '76. But um, we've completed over a thousand boats now altogether but uh, not all catamarans we only we only went into the catamaran business about 1997 and how many catamarans have you built um about 25 we've we've mixed them in with other boats in the early days but now now basically we're on catamarans only and are they all working in the offshore wind Industry. No, no, they're working in um, all the industries there are really. We've got dive charter boats, fishing charter boats, uh, ferries, survey boats, uh, the wind farm boats of course, and just uh, even we, we've even got a couple of just as general pleasure boats for long range cruising. Tell me more about the wind farm boats, how did that evolve in the history of your business? Uh, the wind farm boat started with Terry, the owner of this boat basically, and uh, he called me one day and said I'd like a boat, but um, could it would it be any good as a wind farm boat? And um, I had a look at what he wanted and what other people were doing, and I said yes, we can. With a few customised modifications, we can uh, we can do it. And I'm just absolutely certain that our boat would improve on the quality of, of boats that are already on the market because of the features we have. Tell me a bit more about those features. Well, as I said earlier, about the um, the whole design is the is the main feature that makes this boat work. It's so slim uh, at the bow that when the, when the boat heads into a sea or heads onto a tower, the waves just go underneath without any any movement on the boat. Basically, it's just very smooth all the time. And that leads to increasing efficiency of operation. Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. It's each hull is very very much slimmer than you would have on a much more conventional catamaran, so uh, you need um, considerably less horsepower to make this boat go fast. And um, just with two, two 350 horsepower engines, it will do 30 knots plus. Whereas uh, some boats would be struggling to do 20 knots. But because of that, we can uh, we can save considerable quantity of fuel. So it's a very green vessel. Very green, yes. There's probably isn't one greener, I would say, in the country at the moment. We've. Uh, Terry has saved something like 800,000 litres of fuel in his uh, first year of working. Bloody, that's impressive. But it is. It's enough to buy another boat.